The sorrow, tears and pain left behind by the early morning downpour of August 27, 2017 is still being felt by residents of the state as the state governor wheels in pain on how to rebuild the affected local government areas. Thank you. At a news conference in Abuja, the state governor appeals for assistance in addition to the dredging of the river Benway by the federal government. The Benway state government is making arrangements to amend some of those repairs, but honestly, it is beyond our capacity to restore the damage that was caused as a result of this flooding. We look forward for good-spirited individuals, organizations, corporate bodies, uh, international organizations to come to our aid. Away from the effect of the flood and appeal for assistance, the governor reaffirms the commitment of the people of Benue State to a united Nigeria and cautions those calling for division of the country. Let us, whether we're agitating for restructuring, whether we want anything done, it is important that we must remember that we have no other country other than Nigeria. So there are laws guiding the country. And as a people, we must be law abiding. And at all times, we must know that it is the law that is guiding us not to exceed our boundaries. The August 27, 2017 torrential downpour, which displays over 100,000 residents, caused the river Benue to overflow its banks across the marshy plains around Makudi, washing off a deluge of muddy water into thousands of homes in 21 out of 23 local government areas.